folks think I keep clicking on, keep on clicking on. Guess what happened? When that mask slipped, it revealed a snapping turtle. <laughs> When that mask slipped, it revealed an ugly, nasty, snapping turtle log. And you would be foolish, even though we're going to do it anyway, but you would be foolish to crucify yourself for being fooled by a good mask. See, I don't ever want us to lose our accountability. We make mistakes. Chosen one don't mean mistake less and mistake free. Matter of fact, it may mean that we don't make more mistakes than the average bear. I don't know. But that mask slipped. And you saw something ugly. However, you're still holding yourself accountable while crucifying yourself for the mask. When in all actuality, it is just that, a mask. So you have to go back through every encounter Every situation, be it at your job, be it your home, school, or whatever. And basically negate everything that was said. Because it was said from behind a mask. That mean the good moments and the bad. Sorry to say negated like five minus five zero because it was all done behind the guys beguiled and tricked as soon as you see the snapping turtle up That was your exit. Should have took off, but you didn't. You hung around. It's like seeing, it's like seeing something you never seen before. I watched this show called Alone, and they go out into the wilderness. And sometimes. They hear these things in the woods and they get paralyzed. Not in fear, but in intrigue. Like, what is that? Did I see what I thought I saw? Did I hear what I thought I heard? And sometimes the longer you're intrigued with the mask, the higher the possibility of that thing destroying you. See, your intrigue and your interest and your imagination is a gift. But it can also be a gift and a curse. Because sometimes you can spend so much time figuring something out that it makes you physically sick. And it takes you out of yourself. I, I give the gaming analogy all the time. I had a client, she was talking about her son. She says, he's so immersed in this world that he don't even want to eat. She can't even get him to come down and eat dinner because he's locked into the game. He's locked into a different world. And that can happen to us too as chosen people. We can get so locked in 
and intrigued that you forgot your real world, the world that you know. You got caught trying to figure something out. Like, well, what's that? I don't understand. So now I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying to I'm trying to work it out. It was a snapping turtle. And the first time you heard it, you should have you should have got up out of there. It's okay. We just tell them the story so we give them grace for the next time.